Immigrants embody the best of what it means to become an American. Uh, if you think about it this way, immigrants move here from their homes thousands of miles to a different alien culture where they have to learn a different language, a different way of doing business, a different way of uh, fitting in, and they do it spectacularly well. I mean, and that is really the story of America. America was populated and Americans spread out west into new frontiers at great personal risk, at great economic risk, and they overcame barriers and became Americans in the process. Now we're seeing the same thing happen today. The only difference is immigrants are coming from different places. So instead of coming from places in Europe, um, they're, and in, um, they're coming to the U.S. from East Asia, they're coming to the U.S. from India, from Central and South America. So the faces and the names might be different, but the process is the same. And we see these similar trends in terms of entrepreneurship, in terms of rugged individuality, and even in things like uh, spirituality and uh, religious affiliation. Um, and immigrants are overwhelmingly more entrepreneurial than Americans on average. That doesn't mean Americans are bad, that just means that immigrants are sort of the best of their culture. They're the best ones who want to come here and the best ones who want to set up shop, and they overwhelmingly do. Um, in terms of individualism, immigrants um, overwhelmingly strike it on their own. A lot of them seek self-employment, a lot of them seek to work with Americans away from their families they leave behind in other countries, and they build a new identity here in the United States. They become Americans in the process of that. And that's really the tale that's been told numerous times throughout our history, uh, whether it's with English immigrants and Scottish, the Irish, Jews, Poles, um, Eastern Europeans, and now with Chinese, Vietnamese, Indians, uh, Mexicans, and other Hispanics. It's a process that continually renews the United States, brings in new blood, new ideas, and new energy uh, into this country. And I think there is nothing more quintessentially American than that revival that occurs through immigration.